Okay, so I want to point out a problem that I have every now and then, and I need help with this problem. It is very annoying. If anybody can help me with this one, I would appreciate it so much. It actually saved me so much headache and trial and tribulation. So let's point the problem out. This is a song that I'm working on, but I'm going to mute all of the vocals because I don't want to leak this out. But I'm going to show you all the problem that I'm having just with the beat. We can listen to the beat. So when we play the beat in FL Studio, I'm going to play it at the loudest part, right? It's just a little choir beat with some drums or whatever. But we're going to listen to the, the bass, listen to the, the drums, the 808, and all that good stuff. And um, let's just take a listen real quick. That last part, the last part where the bass is ending right there, and it's like a snare and something else hitting right there, I'll play it again. That's the part I want to pay attention to. That part. Now, that sounds perfectly fine. I love it. But watch this, though. Here go the problem. I like everything. I like the way it's sounding. Now, let's export it. Watch what happened when I try to export this so right now i'm exporting it right did you hear that little click listen did you hear the little click i'm not talking about the fl studio beep because after you export something in fl studio it's supposed to beep but with the beep there was an annoying little click pop sort of delay sound and also, every time that happened, if you look at the meter, if you look at my meter right here, the meter is frozen. Okay, so my meter is frozen, and I'm not even playing nothing, but the meter is showing frozen just like that. It's even frozen like that on my OBS, too. So I would have to reopen the beat to unfreeze the meter. Let's do that now. What's going on? Is it some in my settings? Has anyone else had this problem? Watch my meter. It's going to go back to normal. See, now the meter's back normal. And the crazy thing about it, if I go and listen to the exported beat, the exported beat has this horrible, let's just listen. I'm going to show you the the real problem too, how this thing ain't just what we see in here. It even goes deeper than that. Let's go listen to the file I just exported, right? I want to start right off at that bass ending part that I was telling you about. Where the bass end at, let's skip it right to that part. All right. Now, you hear? You hear that? I'm skipping it to that bass part that I told y'all about earlier. Listen to it now with the exported file. It sounds horrible at the end. Listen. Did you hear the 808 distort around the snare mark? Let's go back to the original one. Because if we go back to the original file, with the original project file, and listen to it, Right? We go back to that original project and I'm going to turn the vocals off again. We don't want to hear the song, just the beat. And let's go back to that end part again. Here it is right here. Let's listen to it. Sounds perfect. It sounds perfect when it's in FL Studio. But if I export this right now, it's going to have a horrible click sound at the end. And then the, the meter is going to get frozen. And when I try to listen to the exported file, let's listen to it one more time. And you will see how horrible that 808 sound at the end. Watch. Did you hear that? You heard that? Let's, let's listen to that again. It sounds horrible. Listen. 
When when the eight oh eight uh when the eight oh eight and the snare hit at the same time, it distorts. But it sounds perfect in FL Studio. It only sounds horrible when I export it. One more time. Yeah, it's like the eight oh eight hops into my right ear. And it's, it's, I could just hear these subtle distortions in the 808 at certain parts only after the export. It doesn't sound that way in the program. See, one more time in the program. That sounds great. And I just can't figure this out. And um, it is so annoying that you work on one thing and then you export this whole other distorted thing. So if anyone could help me out with that, I would appreciate that. Please get in the comment sections. Um, please, somebody address this one. This is something that I'm sure other people probably have this problem too. But yeah, help me figure this one out. Thank you so much.